Hello, hello, hello. Um, welcome back to my channel. Uh, for anyone who is new here, um, thank you for stopping in. And this is kind of like what I have going on. Um, I know you've probably seen a lot of the butterfly papillon stickers here lately, but I think this is going to be a cute one. So I want to use this in my journal spread for this coming week. So I'm actually going to switch this because this is not my journal spread. Let's get started. So I want to do butterflies this week, just, just butterflies. Um, so I'm going to have to like white out some of this stuff over here, which is fun. Um, it's not like I'm not used to it. I just opened a new whiteout, and for some reason, this one gets stuck a lot. So I'm not thrilled about that. But um, it's not so bad. Um, I've actually been using the Signo pen lately for whiting stuff out but tonight I'm kind of trying to hurry because I'm tired and I want to go to bed so I'm sure y'all I'm sure I'm sure y'all understand so um, let's see if we can get this one on here straight um, I feel like it should go up a little and now I'm gonna have to like redo that whole thing um, well at least this one and that one. Okay. I just want the whole thing in in the frame if that makes any sense. Okay. Now that paper came off right there. So let's just snip that because nobody's going to really be able to tell this sticker over here I'm trying not to be too precise about things because I'm like I said I'm so tired I just want to go to bed I'm going to like do it out of the box just a little and then we can just take this extra right here and shave it right off. Sometimes, like I said, it does leave like a ghosting line. It didn't just now, which is great, but sometimes it does. FYI for any newbies out there. So I want to put this um, floral here. I don't know if that's how I want it, but let's just see. I've got a quote as well. I'm just going to line it up. Like that. Okay, so let's move this a little. I don't know. It's ripping my paper. I don't know what's going on. Did y'all see the Happy Planner, the new Happy Planner commercial they've got? So cute. It's really cute. Here, let me see. Maybe I should have put that over more. I don't know. I'm just tired. I just want to sleep. Okay. If I do it this far down though, it's going to cut off that bottom. I don't really want to do that. So I wanted it, you to be able to see the bottom. So maybe I'll just cut off this edge over here. goodness I think I just sliced through the paper what is going on tonight oh my goodness I just want to pull it up a little my goodness 
I don't know what's going on. It's ripping. This paper's just uber sticky, I guess. Get it down. Okay, that one goes on top. I have these nails, so I, it's hard to press down, especially with this one because it's already popped off. So I had to like glue it back on with some. Um, it's not really. I used Gorilla Glue to begin with, but it didn't work very very well. So I borrowed my um, stepdaughter's nail glue, which worked a lot better. Duh. Okay. I usually use this part of my nail. Okay. Now, let's see. I wanted to use this butterfly. And I'm going to use the pen on this one because it's so translucent. And because it scrapes off, like, so well. Um, so if you don't really know where you're sticking it, you just do this, let it dry, stick it wherever you want, and then it um, you can scrape whatever you want right off after all is said and done. Okay, so I'm going to stick that one back and go up top and try to do some boxes up here so how do I have these again I had this one over this one let's see I don't want to be too fussy about this just want to cover up that lunch And that one. Uh oh, sorry. Well, just go ahead and do the whole thing. I just can't get it on straight, you know? Is it just that kind of night? Here, let me like turn it and see if this helps me get it on straight. I think, oh, I forgot that line. Goodness gracious. Totally forgot about that. Too much. Okay, let's see. You have to do it the right angle or it will leave like a ghosting. Yeah. Can you really see that? I don't know. And I don't even know if it's straight. I still don't even know if it's straight, but if you like take the whole thing at the right angle, you can kind of get it to be clear, but okay. And then I have this one. Let's go ahead and do this line. Here. Okay. Okay. There we go. So I had that one like that. Okay, let's grab my butterfly. And I wanted him to be... It's pretty much like that. 
Watch how much easier this stuff comes off. You know? It's so much easier. Now I have two more butterflies to go over here. This one's going to be like this. Now, all you have to do is just wait for it to dry. That's the only drawback. Other than that, everything else is better than regular whiteout. But you do need to wait for it to dry in case you want to move it. Now, if you know you're not moving it, go for it. Just stick her down. Okay, we'll let it dry. And then, let's see, this one. Oh, wait, actually. Okay, let's do this other side. Like here. I want it to be straight. Let's see. Yeah, that's straight. And then this one underneath. So I want to go right out. And this one. I try to stick to like the same butterflies and color scheme the whole thing so it looks more cohesive you know so let's see okay with this book you can really get carried away and just have like a lot of color going on and I didn't want to do that. I just wanted to stick to the same, um, you know, two or three colors. I mean, obviously there's more colors than that, but the three main colors, two, three main colors. And um, the same, like, kind of images. So, should I do this one? Like that? Yes, why not? That way it looks like they're kind of flying and then they're in the same order here and kind of here and... Okay, I'm just gonna grab a few. Let's see. Yeah, I think it was here. And then it was like this. This one will be easy, at least. I'm not all about easy, but tonight I am. <laughs> And if you leave it uncapped, it does take a minute to get going. Perfect. Okay. Hopefully I put that butterfly down right, because I was wanting this flower to be like... Ah, it's not right. That flower's not right. Um, come up. Don't rip my page. Don't rip the sticker. It did rip a little. Um, okay, that'll work. Cute, cute, cute. I'm going to cut that. Right here on the edge, cause, cause I just wanna. I 
Hopefully you guys can't see my head. <laughs> I know you can see my hair. My hair is so long. Mm. Okay. Butter. I should have put it underneath, but. So, as you can see, I decided to add a girl. And I know I said I wanted all the white space, but it just seemed to have something that was like missing and I feel like she just totally completed the spread so like it's like very French and I think the dress is like the exact same color or pretty close pretty spot on um as the like you know burnt red color and she just looks so beautiful so yeah i just wanted to show you guys i just stuck her on really quick i didn't even really do much um thinking behind it but i just wanted to make sure and show you guys before i stuck this in my planner and again thanks for watching all right have a good night bye